ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Game Winning Go Hockey. This is your host, Bobby Baggy Donuts, and today we found the last interview that you never heard with Mark Andre Fleury about leaving the Golden Knights with the interview with Kelly McCrimmon. Okay, guys, here's the interview. Hey, can you hear us okay? I can hear you fine, Gert. Cool. Thanks. Uh, thanks to the members of the media for joining our uh, press conference today. Uh, we will uh, start uh, with an opening statement from our general manager, Kelly McCrimmon. Kelly? Uh, good afternoon to the members of the media. Thank you for uh, being available. Uh, today we uh, completed a trade with uh, the Chicago Blackhawks for uh, uh, Marc-Andre Fleury. And uh, just to give uh, the people on the call uh, uh, some background on, uh, you know, two things, I guess, uh, the, the rationale behind it. Uh, two hours later. Uh, as well as the process that we uh, uh, used throughout. Uh, I begin, I guess, uh, by saying... Uh, A few moments later. Uh, uh, these were conversations that began between uh, Mark Andre and myself at our exit meetings on uh, June 29th. Right. Uh, uh, at that time, uh, I told Mark that I uh, 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 couldn't say for sure uh, what we would do with our uh, goaltending for the upcoming year. Right. Um, oh my God! Stop your fucking lying. Uh, I said to him, I wanted to treat him professionally. I wanted to treat him with respect. I wanted to have open lines. Uh, Two hours later. Uh, communication. I wanted him to be fully aware of any discussions that I might have uh, with teams. Uh, I wanted him to be completely comfortable if he heard uh, rumors or uh, uh, you know saw things uh, out there that uh, you know made him uncomfortable or made him curious that he uh, certainly uh, uh, should feel free to call me. Uh, I believe I can. Uh, we spoke many times from uh, from that day. Oh my God! Stop your fucking lies. Uh, up until uh, uh, you know, as recently as uh, the, the Saturday that I spoke with his uh, representatives for uh, 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 the final time uh, uh, on. Uh, July the 12th, I believe we spoke three times. I, I made uh, uh, Flower uh, aware of Chicago's interest. We had uh, an open discussion about that. You suck! And uh, 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 you know any other team uh, that I spoke to or any other team that contacted me. Two hours later. Uh, 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 from the time that I met with uh, Mark Andre on June 29th uh, uh, <laughs> until uh, up to and including a new team uh, who contacted me. Blow up! For the first time on Saturday, uh, of which I made uh, them aware. <laughs> So I think that uh, communication throughout this process was very good. Right. I told, uh, uh, you know, I told Mark on the, on the at the exit meeting, you know, I want to be able to uh, 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 look him in the eye and tell uh, and tell myself and make him understand or make him feel that he's been treated. A few moments later. Uh, 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 professionally throughout uh, uh, this, uh, this uh, time frame. Wow. Uh, with respect to, uh, uh, and I, I should I should conclude. Uh,
with respect to this morning. You suck. Uh, the rumors hit uh, Twitter before I spoke to Mark Andre Fleury. We had not. Bullshit. Uh, in fact, even completed the trade call. We hadn't begun the trade call with uh, with NHL Central Registry. Oh my God! Stop your fucking lying. Uh, we would never speak to a player before uh, you got to the trade call in case. Uh, things don't, uh, don't unfold. So with respect to this morning, Twitter before we had our trade call. Oh, shit. A few moments later. Uh, uh, completed, and, uh, uh, and and yet, as I've just detailed, uh, um, you know, there was uh, many discussions uh, throughout the time leading up uh, until today. Found would you please do I in the world? Me ta here at all. Uh, in terms of the why, uh, 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 what's the rationale behind the move? I, I think uh, as you uh, on the call here, you suck. We would all know we've been really fortunate. We had two great goaltenders <laughs> uh, in our organization with Mark Andre and uh, and Robin Leonard. <laughs> uh, uh, I give. Uh, both players a lot of credit. We made the decision to go with uh, with that tandem last year based on a number of factors. Uh, uh, we um, uh, uh, collectively won the Jennings Trophy. Mark Andre uh, individually won the Vesna Trophy. We <clears throat> had 40 wins, uh, which was tops in the NHL. We suck. Uh, tied for uh, the President's Trophy. One more out of you, and you are grounded, Mister. I am not joking. Uh, we had a successful playoff. We definitely uh, uh, benefited from uh, both of those goaltenders. I think that uh, when you look uh, uh, forward to this year, uh, I, I think that that same scenario might have been a little harder to manage. I, I mentioned uh, just a minute ago that I give both uh, Mark Andre and Robin a great deal of credit. Right. <laughs> two goalies that are both starters and and I don't know that uh, there would have been the same appetite to do it uh, the same way from those players neither uh, neither goaltender to their credit expressed any uh, any concern or any issue it just uh, I guess more uh, my own observations uh, with respect to that you suck and then I guess uh, you know it ties into uh, that you need uh, cap space to uh, to improve and I know last year being a cap team if we're going to two hours later
Just sing a song and think about sunny weather. Happy trails. Till we meet again.